Caution step one. Repeat your message in as many ways as possible, as many times as possible, while still avoiding detection. Why do you think you hear the same commercial over and over again? It's not because they're trying to make sure everyone hears it, it's because they know that you need to hear the message repeatedly until it gets into your head. But you can't just go read the word God and think you know what's going on. Can't do it. You got to look up the definitions, and that's what the Lord told me to do for y'all. Brainwashing step two. Include subliminal messages in as many places as possible. Brainwashing step three. Condition your victim to associate your message with primitive things like sex. Can you please not put that in there? Hey YouTube, I hope this video comes out okay. Um, there's a new anti-clacker in town that's trying to expose Clack. He's done a very good job. So far he's only made a couple of videos, so this video is for the sole purpose of plugging him. Now I've al already introduced you to uh, Ash, Rock of Truth. I've done a couple of videos in support of him. And uh, now I want to do this video in support of uh, Gene Revel, R-E-V-E-L. You see down here on the bottom of the screen. I'll put the links in the description. Um, he did a video the other day uh, explaining how Click was being a hypocrite, and now he's just come out with another one. So, um, my experience with the latest is the sound is a little bit off, so I had to um, rely a little bit on my stereo system. I run my sound through a 1000 watt stereo amplifier so I was able to hear everything you guys may or may not be able to hear all the video but you can still use the closed caption to read but he's done a really good job um, outlining exactly what Cleck has been doing so um, you should be comfortable let's see if I can uh, just bounce around through this I don't want to you know give the whole crux of his video away I want you to go see it but you see here on the screen where he's showing his comments and how his own comments have been removed. It's like more more comments and Cleck was sniveling and crying about uh, Ash allegedly removed, which he did not, and Ash has clearly proved it. So if you notice, he's done his homework. He's made pretty good videos. My only problem with his videos so far, like I said, is his sound. But see on the screen here, he's done his homework. This guy deserves some credit. And he's asking <laughs> point Nick questions. He says, yes or no, did you accuse Ash of removing the word of God from his channel? And he goes all through here. And he asks very various questions. You guys really should see this. Yes or no, did you reply to any of Troy Richards' comments that contain the word of God? And uh, then he goes on to ask, did you remove any of those comments, etc., etc.? He said, yes or no, wasn't it hypocritical of you to delete them, especially after you rebuked Ash for the same thing, even though your accusing were not substantiated, substantiated and mine were. So there it is, case in point. Kudos to uh, Gene Revel. Like I said, I'll put the links in the description to his channel. Hope you guys give him some love. I've been beating this beast for uh, a, a good four years. I'm really tired of it. I'm glad to see some people stepping up. You've got Gene stepping up, you've got Ash stepping up, you've got um, We Do Not Consent, Ohio's stepping up, you've got Braveheart stepping up, you've got uh, even Steve, Steve Flesher, which is mainly a, a Raptor dude, but uh, he even stopped to shoot the time to expose Clegg. And there's others in the past, there's a lot of others. So you Cleckites that see this, and you, you know, you trolls, you need to wake up because we don't really have a bone to pick with Clegg on a personal level. It's his doctrine and his shady tactics that we have a problem with. And we're doing our very best to pull you guys out of the grip of the devil. And that's it. Take it or leave it. We're doing our very best to warn you. We love you in Christ. And many of us have been in the same boat that you are. Thank God the Holy Spirit pulled us out. Now we're trying to pull you out. Please listen. Please listen. Collect is bad news. I'm telling you right now. He's bad news. News. He's a liar. He's a deceiver. He's been busted so many times. I've done well over 40 videos at this point exposing him. I've exposed him every way I know how to do it. 
I'm ready to retire from this. I've got other things to do. We're trying to get a Feed the Kids program off the ground. We're struggling, you know, putting that together. It's just not falling in place the way we want to. We're planting gardens. We're go growing worm, trying to get worm guards, uh, farms going. Um, so we won't be dependent upon the good people that have donated to us. Um, you know, I believe in self-sufficiency. We're trying to be as self-sufficient as possible. You know, and I'd just like to thank for all those that have donated and helped us in the past. You know, I just want to point something out. A lot of these people are on Social Security themselves. They're not rich. You know, and they, they deserve a thousand, you know, kudos for stepping up and helping us. You know, our truck blew, our clutch, we got that fixed, we're ready to go to the hill. But logistics and trying to put everything together, one of our girls is pregnant and that we've lost her and we just got some kinks we're trying to work out but we're still going to get up on the hill and uh, get the, feed, the feeding program going but uh, back to this, support this uh, Gene fella and also Ash so I can kind of retire from this I'm tired of it, I've been beating this horse a long time I'm kind of tired of it So, with that, love you, mean it and uh, thanks for listening and, and support some of these other people because I'm really getting really super tired of doing flag videos. But if nobody else will do them, I will do them. But with that, take care. Love you. God bless you. Stay close to Jesus. He's the answer. Things are getting really freaky in the world. Bye now.